Hello everyone, hope you're doing good. If your OBS studio is crashing, not opening or if any error is coming, we will be doing only three to four simple steps to fix this problem. So let's go ahead and do the first step. So here we need to do a right click in the start icon and then go to settings. Now in the settings, at the left hand side where we have system, we will click on that and then we will go to display. Now under display, here under related settings, we have advanced display and graphics. So we will go to graphics. And here we need to search for OBS. So if OBS is installed, it will be right here. So let's example, uh, let's take an example. If this is a um, OBS player, I'll select that and I'll go to options and here I will select high performance. So instead of let windows decide, we will select high performance and I'll click on save. Now the next step is to click on the search icon and type fire wall and you will find allow an app through windows firewall, check firewall status, windows defender firewall. So you don't have to click under firewall and network protection. You need to select windows defender firewall or click and allow an app through windows firewall. So I'll click on windows defender firewall and it will open up like this private network or whatever the network you have. And you need to click on this allow an app or feature through windows defender. I'll click on allow an app. Now, the moment I click on that, we will see the list of apps which is allowed or not allowed. So I will click on change settings. And here we have an option. So here you need to check for OBS Studio. And let's say if, if this is a OBS Studio, you just need to select that and you need to click on you just you don't have to do anything now so let's say if you do not find OBS studio then you need to click on allow another app and then browse and then go to C Drive and if you're using 32-bit then select program files x86 and if you're using program uh, I mean 64-bit then go to program files now here you need to select the OBS and you just need to click on open and you need to click on add and then you need to do the check mark just like that once you're done with the check mark you need to click on okay so in this manner you are allowing obs studio in firewall and then we will move to the next step once this is done we need to do one more step is to once you have the icon on your OBS studio, firstly, you need to restart the computer as you have done two things. And to make the changes effect, we need to restart the computer first. And once this is done, you need to do a right click on that OBS studio and you need to click on run as administrator. All right. If you still have issues, then you can repair your OS. I mean, the operating system, whether you're using Windows 10 or Windows 11. So here you need to click on search icon and type CMD and then run as administrator. And then we need to click on yes. And here you need to type SFC space forward slash scan like this. Once you have typed it, hit enter. This will begin the system scan. And once this is done, you need to restart the computer. And most probably this will fix the OBS studio not responding or OBS Studio not opening. So I hope you have enjoyed this very short tutorial. Guys, please hit the like and subscribe. I'll see you in the next tutorial. Have a wonderful day.